I'm Mike Hart. Here's what we're following on this Friday. A convicted sex offender is suing the sheriff's department for reportedly not registering them at their home address, which is 2,000 feet from a school. According to court documents obtained by 23ABC, the individual whose name is not listed on the complaint is required to register as a sex offender, according to the California Sex Offender Registry Act. However, a county ordinance does not allow registered sex offenders to live within 2,000 feet of a school. Now, according to the these documents, KCSO told the plaintiff because of the ordinance, it would be a violation if the county were to register them at the address in question. The complaint claims that it's illegal for KCSO to bar them from registering. The petitioner is requesting that a judge allow the person to register at the address until a final decision is made in this case. Dan, the Sheriff's Department is tuning up for the 25th Annual Battle of the Badges event at CSUB. Check out this video posted to social media. Oh, they're serious. All the proceeds to benefit the Police Activities League. Tickets are $20. Ringside will cost you $40. The action will take place Friday, April 5th. Doors open at 5.30. The fighting starts at 7. And today, the Kern County Veterans Service Department will commemorate Welcome Home Vietnam Veterans Day at their facility on Golden State Avenue. Everyone's welcome to come out and pay tribute. It will include a garrison flag provided by the Kern County Fire Department. There will also be a performance by the Sheriff's Office Color Guard. The event draws big crowds every year, so if you'd like to head out and honor our veterans, make sure you get there early. Welcome home. Vietnam Veterans Day begins at 10 a.m. All right, let's bring in uh, Amanda Mason right now. Get a check of your Friday forecast. And it should be a wonderful day, especially for those outside events. We are seeing sunshine in the valley, calm winds. Bakersfield of a high of 68, low of 45. We're mainly seeing those upper 60s in the valley. Grapevine is at a 62, low of 43, a little cooler. And we're looking at our mountain communities. It is going to be breezy. We could reach wind gusts up to 20 miles per hour. But we're seeing Tehachapi high of 55, low of 35. Lake Isabel high of 63, low of 41. And Fraser Park high of 55, low of 29. Today starts that warming trend, so we will start to warm up as the days continue into Monday. But the desert community is also breezy, reaching wind gusts up to 30 miles per hour. Please be safe out on the roads, but we're seeing our mid to high 60s for the desert and lots of sunshine. All right, Amanda, thank you for that. And that's a look at some of the stories we're following this morning. Be sure to tune in later today. We'll have more updates for you across our digital platforms.